Can you please introduce yourself? Good morning. Um, my name is Mr. Simon Jones. Uh, I'm a consultant maxillofacial surgeon at the Royal Gwent Hospital Newport uh, in the UK. How long have you been using Mectron piezo surgery for? Oh, I've been using uh, the uh, Mectron uh, piezo surgery now for six years. What made you change from traditional rotating and oscillating tools to piezo surgery? Uh, what made my change uh, was that there was a lot of literature around uh, using this equipment and I felt that uh, it looked like it would be safer and more beneficial for um, the patients. And lots of this was discussed at uh, conferences that I'd been to around, around the world. Which procedures are you using it for? I use the, uh, the PISA for, for all procedures I use to do with bony work of the head and neck. So I use it for my osteotomy work and that includes uh, segmental osteotomies, um, genioplasties. Um, it's particularly helpful with using with the new uh, cutting guides that we're using for 3D uh, osteotomies. I also like to use it for uh, bone grafts, harvesting bone grafts from various sites, in particular the Aliak Crest. Um, and I particularly like it for shaping of the bone graft uh, once the bone graft has been harvested. Are there today surgeries that you would not to do without a Mactron piezo surgery? Um, no, as long as the uh, surgery involved uh, bone um, um, cutting, I would now use the piezo surgery for all uh, uh, that type of surgery. Thinking about your patients, which are the main intraoperative and postoperative advantages you have observed for them? Uh, the main uh, advantages uh, for intraoperatively is there is a more tactile feel when using the piezo. So I think I can have more effective, more, more complex cuts that go uh, closer and less damage to the vital structures such as the nerves and arteries. Um, this gives me a uh, much, much better outcome, much more predictable cuts um, than, the than the normal effective rotary or, or saws that we used to use. In your opinion, is there any disadvantage in using Mactron piezo surgery? No, in, in, my, in my service now there's no disadvantage to using the uh, piezo surgery. Is total surgery time same more or less using Mactron piezo surgery? Um, the surgical time that I've looked at, and uh, we've done a study on this in my department, we found that actually the surgical time is uh, now less using the piezo surgery and that has now enabled us to uh, carry out our surgery effectively and uh, in the case of uh, bilateral sagittal split osteotomies we're now able to do this as day surgery. How does such a learning curve compare with the learning curve needed to manage any other new technology in surgery? Uh, the learning curve uh, I found um, is uh, almost simpler than some other nerve surgery because it's such an easy to use uh, saw, it's very tactile, you know exactly what you're cutting through, it's very difficult to make mistakes with it that I found actually uh, the learning curve w was, was much quicker than with previous uh, rotary uh, instruments. Is there anything else that you would like to add? Yes, uh, following on from the last question, I would like to add that um, I found it extremely useful for training. So I train a lot with the piezo surgery and I have lots of positive feedback from trainees um, saying that they love to train um, using the piezo surgery as they feel it's more comfortable and safer to use. Thank you very much, doctor, for your time. Thank you very much.